نحمد ہو انسلی اللہ رسول کریم اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم رب شرح لی صدری و یسر لی امری واخل العقدت من لسانی یفقہ قولی و جعل لی وزیر من اخلی اللہم فکہنا فی الدین آمین سم آمین السلام علیکم و رحمت اللہ و برکاتہ ٹرانسلیشن سورة البقرہ ورس 234 والذین واو زبروا and الذین this is a relative pronoun for the masculine plural those who yutawafauna wow fa ya means to take to get in complete control or charge or to take away completely yutawafauna the ya at the start shows that it is an imperfect verb and with vow noon at the end it becomes an imperfect verb for the third person masculine plural and there is a pesh uh, on ya and this shows that this imperfect verb is not in the active form instead it is in the passive form they are taken in death <coughs> they are they are taken in death or they are their souls are taken in completely min kum from or among you all wa and yadharuna dal ra wow means to leave to forgive to uh, give up wa yadharuna Ya at the start makes it an imperfect verb and they leave and it is for the third person masculine plural. Azwajan. This is the plural of Zawj. Zawj means the spouse or the pair or the couple. This is a plural masculine noun. Spouses. Wayazaruna. And they leave spouses so what do the spouses of those muslim men when they die and they leave their wives behind what do they need to do ya tarabasna ra ba swad wait ya shows that it is an imperfect verb noon zabar na at the end signifies that it is for the third person feminine plural And what do they need to do? They should try to wait for a period. The ta between the root word and ya shows that it is a trial and effort and attempt. Ya tarabbasna, they should wait for a period or a term or they should stop themselves for a term. Bi anfusihinna. Bazir B, by or with Anfusihinna, themselves or their souls. Arba'ata ashhurin. Arba'a, four. This is a feminine noun. Ashhurin, months. Wa ashran, and ten. Arba'ata ashhurin wa ashra, four months and ten, that is ten days. Faiza, then when, balagna, a perfect verb for the third person feminine, plural. Those women, they have reached. Ajalahunna, the end of their term, their waiting periods. Falajunaha, then no blame or no sin alaykum upon you fima in whatever fa'alna 
fa'alna fa'ain lam means to do. This is a perfect verb where the third person feminine plural is doing something. Fa'alna, they did. Fi in anfusihinna in themselves, in their souls, bil marufi. Bazir be with or in maruf, the recognized manner. Wallahu and Allah bima of or in whatever ta'maluna you all do. Khabirun is ever aware. Verse number 235. Wala junaha alaykum. And no blame or no sin upon you all, Fima, in that which aras tum, ain ra zwad, to hint, to suggest, to present, to uh, make, uh, to uh, to highlight in front of people, aras tum, you all hinted, you. All suggested be he at it or with it men of hitba din nisa'i hitba proposal for marriage an nisa the women au or aknantum kaf noon noon means to to make something secret, to conceal, to hide, to try to cover up the entity. Aknantum, you all conceal. You all hide. Fi in anfusikum, yourselves or your souls. You try to hide it, but what is the status? Alimallah, Allah knows. Alima, this Ain Lun, Ain La Mim means knowledge or to know or to have awareness. This is the perfect verb for the third person masculine singular. He knows. Who knows? Alim Allah. Allah knows. What does Allah know? Annakum, that indeed you all, Satas Guru Nahunna, Dal Kaf Ra. To mention, to remember. Now, seen ta at the start shows that there is an attempt. There is um, a seen uh, at the start shows that this imperfect verb is being done in near future. Ta at the start makes it an imperfect verb. Waunun at the end makes it for the second person masculine plural form. Satas Koruna, shortly, soon, will you all remember them? Shortly or soon, will you all mention them? Walakin and but la tu'a'iduhunna that you will definitely remember or mention them, but what don't you have to do in even despite remembering them? La tu'a'iduhunna. La means not or do not. Tu'a'idu. Wa'u a'in dal. Wa'ad means to make uh, an arrangement, to make a deal, to make a promise, to make a pact. Ta at the start shows that it is for the second person. La to'a'idu. Wow, alif at the end shows that it is for the plural form. Do not make a promise. Do not make an arrangement or agreement with them. Sirran, seen raw raw, secretly, hidden, concealed, secretly. Illa, except an that taqulu, you all say qawla ma'rufa. Qawl means a word, a sentence, a thing which has been said. And qawla, 
Kaulan is what? It is a masculine noun. So this is a noun and the adjective for the Kaulan is that what is the word or the conversation like? Ma'roofan, recognized, acceptable, according to the norms. And what else shouldn't you do? Wala ta'zimu. And do not ta'zimu. Ain za mim. Means to have a, a very strong determination, to be determined, to be willed, <coughs> to have a sure, short decision or planning. Wala ta'zimu. And do not be determined. Upon what? Uqda tannikah. Uqda ain qaf dal aqt means the not. This is a feminine noun. Do not be determined upon the not of nikah. The not of the marriage. That is the contract of marriage. Until when don't you have to do that? Hatta until yablu al kitabu ajalahu yablura balam rain means to reach ya in the start shows that it is an imperfect verb nothing indicating it's being plural so it is um, it is the imperfect verb for the third person masculine singular it reaches Al Kitaba, the prescribed, the written, the decreed, the ordered, whatever is ordered and written in the kitab, in the kitab or Quran is what? It is prescribed, it is decreed, or it is ordered by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Ajalahu. Ajal means the time period or the duration. It's time period or its end of term walamu you all should know an imperative verb ordering the second person masculine plural annallaha that indeed allah yalamu he knows ma whatever fi is anfusikum yourselves or your souls fahzaruhu Ha zal ra to be cautious, to be afraid, to be aware of, or to be uh, afraid of. Fa zabar fa so or thus be cautious, be aware of ha who him. The pronoun who here is pointing towards Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala who knows whatever is in the souls. So you all be cautious or you all be aware of him. And you all should know that indeed Allah is most forgiving, halimun, ever forbearing verse number 236 la junaha there is no blame no sin alaykum upon you all in if if you all divorce the women ma who lam not Tamasuhunna. Meem seen. Seen must means to touch. Tamasu, you all have touched. Hunna, them. Au, or tafrizu. Farazwa. Faraza means to make something obligatory, compulsory, or something which has been specified. Autafrezu, or you all make obligatory, you all have specified. La hunna, lamzabarla, for hunna, them, farizatan, an obligation, 
a specification and here it is referring to what the dower or the bride's money the husbands give at the time of nikah or at the time of marriage means to get a benefit or an advantage and you all give benefit to Hunna them Allah upon Al Musiri, the person who is who has uh, abundant means. Wow, seen Allah upon Al Musiri. Wow, seen Ain means something which is in abundance, which is in openness and which is in uh, a great amount al musiri means the person who has abundant means that is a person who is wealthy or a person who is affordable al al musiri means upon the person who has abundant means or who is wealthy qadaruhu qadara according to his affordability or according to his ability or potential wa ala and upon al muqtiri of ta ra means to be tight to be hand to mouth to have insufficient means or to be poor non affording Al Mukhtari means the person who is of insufficient means, or the person who is poor, or the person who is non affording. Upon the person who is non affording or poor, it is what? Qadaruhu, according to his ability. Mataran, a benefit, a provision, bil ma'aruf, in the fair manner in the recognized manner haqqan it is the right a duty alal muhsinin upon al muhsinin muhsinin ha sin noon means to do uh, to have something in goodness or in excellence muhsin is the person who who does goodness or who behaves with excellence or who does ihsan muhsinin is the plural form of uh, muhsin haqqan ala al muhsinin is a duty upon those who do ihsan or who behave with excellence now let's just revise from the verse number 234. And those who you they are taken in death, minkum, from you all, wayadaruna, and they leave azwajan, spouses. Yatarabbasna bi anfusihinna they should wait for a period with their souls or by themselves ashhurin for how long four months wa ashara and ten faiza then when balagna they have reached ajalahunna end of their terms Fala then no junaha blame alaikum upon them fima in whatever fa'alna they did fi anfusihinna in themselves or for their souls bil ma'rufi in the recognized manner wallahu and allah is bima ta'maluna khabir of whatever you all do ever aware verse 235 wala junaha alaykum and no blame upon them fima in what or in which arastum bihi you 
all suggested or you all presented or you all hinted be he with it min khaitbatin nisa'i of the marriage proposal to the women au or aknantum you concealed it you you tried to make it secretly fi anfusihin anfusikum in or within your souls or your cells alimallahu allah knows annakum that indeed you all satazkurunahunna shortly or soon you will all remember them or you will all mention them walakin and but la tu'iduhunna do not you all make promises or make deals or make an arrangement with them sirran secretly illa except antaqulu that you all say qawla ma'rufa a word recognized a word acceptable wala ta'zimu and do not you all be determined to what uqdatan nikah the knot of marriage the marriage contract hatta until <coughs> yablugh alkitab ajalahu it reaches the prescribed or the decreed term wa'lamu and you all should know annallah that indeed allah ya'lamu he knows ma fi anfusikum that whatever is in your souls fahzaruhu so you all be cautious or careful or aware of him wa'lamu and you should all know annallah that indeed allah is ghafurun halimun most forgiving and most forbearing verse number 236 la junaha alaykum no blame upon you in tallaqtum nisaa if you all divorced the women ma lam tamassuhunna if not you have touched them aw or tafrizu lahunna tafrizu or you all make obligatory or you all have specified lahunna for them farizatan an obligation wa matti'uhunna and you all give them a benefit and what is the benefit ala upon almusiri the persons the person of abundant means or the wealthy or the affordable is what qadaruhu according to his means his affordability or his economic abundance wa alal muqtari and upon the percent of insufficient means or the person who is poor or non affording qadaruhu according to his affordability or ability matam bil ma'ruf a benefit in the recognized way haqqan alal muttaqin it is a duty upon those who do ihsan or who do or behave with excellence sadaqallahu alazim rabbana la tuzigh qulubana ba'da iz khadaytana wa hab lana min ladunka rahma innaka antul wahhab subhanakallahumma wa bihamdika nashhadu an la ilaha illa anta nastaghfiruka wa natubu ilaik subhana rabbika rabbil izzati amma yasifun wa salamun alal mursalin walhamdulillahi rabbil alamin amin summa amin